So the Armstrong Aviators are coming today. They're the third graders, which is our primary grade. We focus mostly on third grade over every grade because the third grade teaks is solar system. They want to know the planets, um, and obviously the planetarium is a perfect place to learn the planets. So they'll be the group that's here today. Because they have so many third graders, they'll have two shows. So they'll have a morning show um, with about 65 students and then they'll have another afternoon show. So they have three standards that we cover in the third grade show. The first standard is they have to know the names of all the planets from the sun. So we give them that foundation, but we also give them a little bit more background knowledge about the planet. So we, we sort of build upon what just what the state wants them to know. They're also expected to know how the Earth, sun and move, move around each other. So we will cover that. Um, and then we want them to know a little bit just about what's in the night sky. So that's that's actually what they learn pre-K to second, so we sort of review that. So every one of our shows, um, it's not just what we show them what's on the dome, but we do some activities, we use costumes, so we'll have a moment where we use costumes. For the third grade show, we have these balls, and so we'll line the planets up in balls. We want them to interact and to not just be them sitting in their seats. And then we end every program with a movie. So their movie is called Perfect Little Planet. It was really big, it covered all of us, it's kind of like Whenever we went in the video of like seeing Mars, it was kind of like real life. Uh, all of the outer planets have rings, but some are just thinner than the other ones. I thought it was cool that the sun was bigger than all of the planets and um, how, how they were different and alike. 